with the stars. Well, one of us. One of us. Me. 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 We'll take home the mirror ball. The mirror ball. The mirror ball trophy. I already have a spot picked up for it. Dancing with the stars premieres Monday on ABC and stream on Hulu. Oh, Finally tonight, if you look at Rob Mendez and simply see a man missing arms and legs, you have likely missed all the heart he has. A football coach who could also double as a life coach. Get on the ball, let's go. Rob Mendez knows all about calling an audible. Reset, reset, reset. The 33-year-old was born without arms and legs as a result of an extremely rare genetic condition. I always got to remind myself of that. You know, don't be your own worst enemy and don't hold yourself back on pursuing what you, you want to really do in life. Good, let's go. That reminder has worked, not allowing his physical condition to keep him from going after his dreams. Yeah, just, well, my friends played football, so I started, you know, going to practices. I wasn't on the team and I was, you know, from a distance watching practice and the coaches, uh, you know, they waved me into to the team huddle and you know they asked me if i wanted to be a part of the team and, and give me a jersey his first job manager of his high school team in gilroy california by the time i was a senior in high school i was wearing the headsets with the coaches and and you know listening to them eventually he became the head jv coach at another school and led that team to the district finals he's now in his 16th year of coaching high school football here we go run it coach mendez uses his shoulders to get around in his custom designed motorized wheelchair his nose to operate his cell phone and his mouth to hold a stylus to write and draw out the plays you know i get really down about sometimes you know especially in my early 20s where you know what if you know what if i did have arms and legs you know where would i be coach mendez credits his success with his family's unwavering support especially his dad for helping him develop confidence you know i think he really tried to adapt to what i was able to do instead of focusing on what i was not able to do one way he helps himself turn life's downs into touchdowns a simple mantra the one thing that always brought me back to to include myself was uh, oh yeah well who says i can't who says I can't a mantra for us all? Thanks so much for watching. David Muir is right back here tomorrow night. I'm Lindsay Davis in New York. Have a good night. ABC News honors winner of nine Edward R. Murrow Awards, including overall excellence in television and radio. ABC News is America's number one news source. Thank you for making World News Tonight with David Muir, America's most watched newscast. Tomorrow, what Bob Woodward and reporter Robert Coster reveal about the transition from Trump to Biden may leave you speechless. The George Stephanopoulos exclusive tomorrow on Tuesday.